everybody welcome back to my project 13 hope everybody's having a great day got the t revel on the dash of my car shooting this video in 1080p not 480p yesterday I uploaded a video and it was only in 480p now thank you for the feedback thank you for wishing me a happy birthday to all of you I appreciate it but you did mention that the video didn't look that good and um, well at 480p it's gonna look okay but yeah it's not gonna look that great I think when I was editing some screenshots into the video and some messages into the video that the settings were appropriately set and that's why it uploaded at 480p I didn't have time to change that so I uploaded it anyway because it was my birthday went out to dinner and a movie with my wife got to see Dunkirk an amazing movie Okay, an amazing movie, Dunkirk. Um, and then went home and, and finished out my birthday with my kids. So, you know, at that point I said, man, I'm gonna upload it regardless because it was more about what I was vlogging about, more what I was talking about was on my mind and on my, you know, on my heart to share with all of you. So, I, it, it, I, just, I just let that go. So, 1080p on this one, as long as you're watching it on a device that gives you 1080p and above, if it's just, a budget smartphone like the Revel that only has 720, it's still going to produce that video at 1080p, but you're only going to be able to watch it in 720p. Okay, because that's all this device has when it comes to uh, the uh, the video resolution as far as, uh, you know, um, what it gives you at 720p. I wish it was 1080p, but it's not. Anyway, with that being said, let me know how everything looks. Let me know how everything sounds. This is just another test to see um, and make sure that everything's working appropriately once it's uploaded and you get to watch it. Uh, you know, this device, yes, it's just a budget device, still a smartphone, and that's basically what I was communicating with all of you yesterday. Now, uh, obviously, I'm still testing it out. I like it. it it's, 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 it's doing what it's supposed to do, and that's being a smartphone. And that's giving me everything that it has um, for it to give me as the user. And that's it. And there's some areas that lack and there's some areas that don't. And that's to be expected. Now, there was a question from one of the viewers that asked me why I didn't pick up the Moto G5 Plus because right now it's on sale. The unlocked variant with no ads at 180 smacks. And I said, well, I'm a T-Mobile customer. I was intrigued and it's a T-Mobile exclusive. So I picked it up. Um, I have 14 days to try it out. I responded by saying that and um, and everything else that I just said. And so, uh, you know, and, I, and I'm super stoked to have brought it in and, and start testing and use it for some of you who are considering this device amongst the other uh, budget devices that are out there. So, you know, you're gonna have to reach into the pile and grab one and choose one, right? I, I just, I review it and hopefully it helps you out. Um, now, I am considering returning the device and getting the money back to pick up the Moto G5 Plus at 180 smacks. Now, because there is nothing wrong with the device, that means I'm gonna have to pay the, uh, the restocking fee which is 30%, and I'm willing to do that because I'm not gonna return a device just to return a device. I pretty much keep my devices, they pretty much sit on my desk, I try to use them all, sometimes I don't, they just sit there, and then I get to the point where I have to sell them for the channel to bring in money to bring in other devices, or I give them to a family member, or sell them to co-workers. I always have somebody asking at work for a device as long as the price is right. So it, I don't just return devices to return devices. But with that being said, it is a device. It is a budget device, um, and only at 125 smacks. Eh, I may just do it to bring in the Moto G5 Plus. What do you think? Let me know down below, because again, I just don't return devices, and I'm willing to pay the price for that, which is a 30% restocking fee at T-Mobile, because this device is working perfectly fine for what it is, and I've. I've I've been stoked to review it, um, but again, 
I, I may just keep it and, and still bring in the Moto G5 Plus, but I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Uh, let me know down below in the feedback. Um, but again, let me know what the quality is like visually and let me know what the audio is like second time around testing the rear video in 1080p. Now remember, if your device only has 720p, that's how you're going to receive it. But if it's 1080p or higher, you should be getting at least that 1080p. Okay, so let me know. Thank you again for uh, the happy birthdays. Uh, again, I had a great, wonderful time. Um, just blessed, man, just totally stoked and blessed. Let me know what you're doing um, to finish out your summer. Let me know what device you're using. And if there's anything else you want to talk about that's not even related to this video, go ahead and share it with me. I appreciate your time. Thanks for being a part of my Project 13 because you are my Project 13. Again, the T-Revel on the dash of my car, 1080p, rear camera. Peace, everyone. God bless. I'm out.